Thank you. President Trump says he believes Congress can pass an emergency coronavirus relief package put forward by Senator Mitch McConnell. I think they're getting very close, and uh, I want it to happen, and I believe that uh, they're getting very close to a deal. Yeah. The majority leader says the $500 billion proposal was kept small in order to win the president's support. I put forward a serious and highly targeted relief proposal, including the elements which we know the president is ready and willing to sign into law. Democrats say the proposal doesn't go far enough. He now says that an emergency relief bill should be limited by only what President Trump will sign. Of course, we could say similarly, the bill should be limited only by what a Democratic House will pass. Neither is true compromise. President-elect Joe Biden says he supports the larger $908 billion bipartisan plan introduced this week as the first step in providing relief for Americans. We need relief now. So I've been urging our congressional Republicans to work on a bipartisan emergency package now. The Biden transition team continues to prepare for when they take over next month. Today, members of the team are meeting with Dr. Anthony Fauci about the vaccine and their pandemic response. I'm very pleased that today we're having the first discussion about a number of things, vaccinations and things like that. Fauci also says this will likely be only the first in a series of meetings with the Biden team.